Hey stylers, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make lip stain out of Kool-Aid. Lip stain is a pigment that absorbs into your lips and gives them a really natural color. This is perfect for someone who has a really busy schedule or if you're going to be attending a party because all you have to do is apply this once and it will give you this long lasting color. You will need Vaseline, Kool-Aid powder, a spoon, a heat safe bowl, and a container. Start off by adding half a teaspoon of Vaseline to your bowl. Then go ahead and microwave this for about one minute. Afterwards, just go ahead and add about half a packet of your favorite colored Kool-Aid. Next, we're gonna go ahead and add about two teaspoons of water. And this is what's really going to activate the pigment aspect of this whole thing. After you add this, you're just gonna go ahead and mix it. Your final product will be in the liquid state. I would recommend that you refrigerate your lip stain and replace it every, I'd say one to two weeks just to avoid any spoilage. I would recommend that you apply this with a Q-tip. If you use your fingers, you'll find that your fingers will end up being very stained and difficult to wash off. I would also recommend that you go ahead and scrub your lips with sugar and honey before applying this so that you don't get any weird markings like this and try to concentrate the lip stain on the outer parts of your lips versus the center or inner part. So this is what the cherry one looks like. This is kind of tricky to show you guys because it is a lip stain so I'm trying my best to clean it off with a makeup remover wipe but um yeah. Here I'm applying the strawberry Kool-Aid and that's what this one looks like. This one actually ended up being my favorite. Let me know which one is your favorite. This lip stain lasted me about four to six hours on the lips. And after I wipe it off with a makeup remover, that's what's left over. That is completely dry, you guys. Isn't it so amazing and vibrant? Here I'm applying a black cherry one. Again, it's going to be difficult for you to see what these actually look like because they are kind of being layered, but you kind of get the idea. Lastly, I'm going to go ahead and apply this grape Kool-Aid. This lip stain will cause a tingling and burning sensation. So if you have cuts on your lips, I would recommend that you wait until those heal up before trying this out, otherwise it's going to burn. Make sure to keep your lips hydrated when you're wearing this lip stain because it does have a tendency to make your lips dry. All right guys, I hope you enjoy all of your beautiful colored lip stains. Did you know that Cleopatra used to wear lipstick made out of crushed ants? What are some crazy ingredients you've heard of that are in our makeup products? All right guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you give us a try, please go and hashtag your photos with Sophie Lipstick so I can find them and like them. Also, please take a moment to follow me on Instagram and Twitter and like me on Facebook so you can stay up to date with all of my videos. Don't forget to stop by tomorrow for a new video on this channel. Thank you so much for watching. Be well and sweet styling.